Proverbs chapter 3, verses 3 and 4, it says, Let love and faithfulness never leave you. Bind them around your neck. Write them on the tablet of your heart. Then you will win favour and a good name in the sight of God and man. Well, we all know what it's like to become hard-hearted. Unfortunately, we see things over and over again repeated on our TV screens or we hear things said over and over and sometimes we come to a point where we just don't care anymore. We've had enough of hearing about it. We, we, we don't want to, to listen anymore. And when we become hard-hearted, we allow love to leave us. It's Hard-heartedness is actually a loss of love. And when we lose love, we lose mercy. We lose our sense of justice. We lose our compassion for others. So it's not just a matter of a loss of love. It's a loss of all those things that make us human. When we lose those things, life can become, it feels much harder. We don't care so much. We don't take the time to do those things that really mean something as much. We don't remember those that need us to remember them. And we forget to show those characteristics that we really need to experience for ourselves from others as well. When we become hard-hearted, we become closed to all those things. But here in Proverbs, it's telling us to let love and faithfulness never leave you. In other words, don't allow yourself become, to become hard-hearted by this world. Don't allow those things to stop you from being human. In fact, it says, bind them around your neck, write them on the tablet of your heart. So those things, love and faithfulness, need to become the very center of who we are. See, when love and faithfulness is central to our lives, all those other things like mercy and justice and compassion and all those things, they all come with it. And we become those kind of people that others want to be around. We become the kind of people that others want to mimic because they understand that when they're around us, we make them feel good about themselves. We lift people up rather than knocking people down. And that's really the Australian way, isn't it? The tall poppy syndrome. But we're not to be like that. And when we when we do these things, when we love and, and are faithful to, to others and to God himself, we will win favour with others. People will respect us. People will um, care about us. They'll support us. That's what it means to never let these things leave you. Don't become hard-hearted. Allow mercy, justice, compassion, let peace, let love and faithfulness be at the very centre of who you are. Practice them every day and you'll find that life won't just be better, but your relationships will be better as well.